a rep in the gym. Every rejection is like a... You know, it's something, it's an interesting dynamic that I wanted to talk about is the fact that, you know, a person that was previously older than me and I saw as smarter than me, which is completely and utterly false because he's a degenerate, likes video games and instant gratification by all metric, he told me to go to university and I asked him the reason behind going to university. And what he said to me surprised me because it was what it wasn't necessarily because it was uncharacteristic it was very very characteristic of this individual more so it was kind of stupid i didn't expect something so stupid to come out of his mouth and he said to me oh go you need to get girls i'm dead serious he said to me go you need to get girls and i was like really that's it. That's the reason behind me spending four years of my life, forty thousand pounds, to go to some it's big, nice establishment where I'm paying a fuck ton of money in order to get girls. That was it. And I thought to myself, like I was weighing up the pros and cons. I could get four years of getting girls, and whoa, you like you, you. having that experience. Which would make me super confident and super fulfilled. Or I could have four years of making money, entrepreneurship, focusing on my dreams, buckling down, put my head down to the stone. I could have that instead. You know, I growing up I fervently followed the education system. I genuinely believed in it. I worked hard in it. I got the good grades. I was only zero till college when I started to derail. And I start, when I started derail, I started derail immensely, immensely so. And because I derailed immensely, I kind of became this individual that was kind of like a social outcast or lazy, seen as lazy, seen as inadequate, as stupid. And I became okay with it because I didn't really give a fuck about anyone's opinion. But thinking about it more, I'm not okay with it because humans are social creatures, right? And I would like to be seen as a respected member of the community. And this was not going to be achieved with me getting shitty grades or even what I did, dropping out of school, which is pretty more of an extreme side. The reasoning behind going to school and getting all that debt and wasting all that time, to me, was completely utter asinine. To spend that much time on bullshit activities that would pay me no dividend, that would pay me nothing, and would consume my soul. See, you block from this. And to me, that was like the eye opener. Jeez. And to me, that felt as if I was working against the current in school because I just, I was, I was barely sentient bro I was in my own world Someone, some girl told me yeah Jimmy you look like you're in your own world oh yeah I was in my own world I didn't care about girls I didn't care about studies I didn't care about nothing what did I want what, what I wanted was freedom I wanted to get out of this classroom I remember seeing the bars of the classroom window and thinking to myself I understand completely and utterly why there's bars on the window so individuals like me won't jump out of them Dead serious. And I also understood something else that was pretty interesting. And that is, money is the end or be all. If I had money, I could just say goodbye. Not even, not even something morbid or perhaps aggressive like fuck you. I would just say goodbye. And I would never see them again. I would live a phenomenal life with money, with paper. And it was a weird revelation. Because it kind of inspired the seeds of entrepreneurship into me. But it also inspired seeds of rebellion within me and I couldn't really enjoy anything that was systematic thereafter like even with my traineeship now I can't really enjoy it university I probably would have hated it apart from me getting girls and I got complacent like, I wouldn't hate it I wouldn't love it but then you know consistent links oh girls whoa.
I don't even know where this video was going anymore. It was going to go to university to get girls, but I think I've just said that enough. It's so stupid. It's me. It's because a lot of men, young men, would think, oh, I'm not stupid because I, I, I need that social experience. Because one of my friends was like, I need that social experience. I need to go outside and I need to feel something and I want to be young. and I'm like, Bro, you're going to spend 40 grand on an experience that doesn't really pay you back. You're gonna spend four grand with that. Sure, go ahead. We're gonna follow the system and its rules. Sure, go ahead. Play it honestly. I'm pretty okay with that. But I myself cannot follow that. It's too much. It's too much of a waste of time. It's too much in general. That would fuck me up. Four or five years of uni. That would seriously fuck me up. I'm gonna call it there, boys. Yeah, I can say this video.